Pulot nung libro na yun ni eh. What book, Ingo? How will they give it back to me if they don't know if it's mine? Who will give it back to you? I know. I will write my name on everything I own. Hmm. Oy, Karen, ang pala. Do you want help in finding your lost book, Ingo? Pakit mo alam. Ang galing mo, ha? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I already know what to do. Okay. I know this. Hat owned by Ingo. I, I a... Hat. Of Ingo. Um, actually, there is a better and shorter way of writing it. There is? Yes. How? By using an apostrophe. Mas mura pa yung papel kaysa sa upholstery. Mm. Apostrophe, Ingo. Apostrophe. Not upholstery. See? Different. Ano ba klaseng materialis yun? Well, it's not a material. An apostrophe is a symbol that we use when we write possessive nouns. Ah, al alam ko yan. Alam ko yan. Yun yung pagmamayari. Akin. Correct. Hmm. So, instead of saying hat of Ingo, mm -hmm. you can just say Ingo's hat. Ah. Mm -hmm. So, the possessive noun there is Ingo's. That is correct. Again, Ingo. Mm -hmm. oh. Wow, pretty. The butterfly's wings are colorful. Yes, they are. Ah. Oh. Hey, Ingo, you just used a possessive noun. I did? Yes, you did. I did. <laughs> I know. Very good. I know. And you know what? What? I will put a sign on my bicycle. Okay, so instead <laughs> of saying bicycle of Ingo, you say... I know, I know. I will write Ingo's bicycle. Very good, Ingo. <laughs> Thank you, Karen. You're now, welcome. you can go back to work. And don't worry about me. Possessive forms of plural nouns, you do not need to write apostrophe plus s. Putting an apostrophe after a regular plural noun is enough. Huh? Hmm. For example, take this word here. Instead of writing apostrophe plus s, you just simply put 
an apostrophe after the word vegetables. Mas matipid pa yun sa tinta. <laughs> the birds tweeting is like music to my ears. Mm -hmm. Now, <laughs> how do you use apostrophe this time? Mm. Birds. Mm -hmm. That's plural. Yes. Birds mm -hmm. tweeting. I wrote it like this. That is correct. You got it, Ingo. I know, I know. Oi, careful! Uh, children, how I wish I could play all day. Just like them. But those are children games. You mean children's games, Ingo? Huh? Eh, ano pa talaga? Sabi mo, tatanggalan ng S kapag plural. Children yes. is plural. Well, yes, that is correct. But only plural words that end in an S are included in the rule. Ah, hindi mo naman nililinaw eh. So, I should say, children's games. That is correct. Mm -hmm. But, if a singular word ends with an S, mm. you may or may not write an S after the apostrophe. <laughs> so I can say, the girl's dress has a ribbon. Correct. Girl's, girl's dress. dress. But the dress ribbon needs to be tied well. Mm-hmm. Dress as ribbon. Very good, Ingo. You got it. Mm, thank you. I'm a fast learner. Yes, you are. Now I know you want to join their game, so go. Thank you. Go before I change Hi, my mind. Hi, Joy. <laughs> you. <laughs> what? You're too old for that. Mag-ingat ka. May pangalan ko yan. Sorry. Can't you see my name is written on it? That is in Go's box. My box. Can we have it? No. My name is on it already. Oh, we go. It's just a box. Let the kids have it. I've been putting my name everywhere. This is hard work, you know. I can't let anyone just take away my things. Well, they are your friends, Ingo, and they asked permission. I think you're becoming stingy, Ingo. Subukan mo kayong magsulat at magdikit ng karatula buong araw. Mangangamoy ka rin. I said stingy, Ingo, not stinky. Mm. Di ba pareho rin yun? No. Stingy is the opposite of being generous, which you are not being right now. Ang ibig sabihin, pagdadamot. Maramot na ba ako? Well, I know you're not, Ingo. It's just you have to learn how to share. I want to share, but what if they don't return what they borrowed? Well, they're your friends, Ingo, and I'm sure they will return your things. And if you share, then you will be able to make people smile. Then you will be able to make people happy. And then you will be happy. And that is what you gain when you share. You know, I felt sad when the children walked on without the box. See? You're not really stingy, Ingo. Uh, stingy! Ingo, not stinky. I said stingy. <laughs> mm. 
Children! Go! Children! Go. I'm giving you the box! Children! It's a great time to share with whomever is there. Your heart you must prepare to show your love and care. In sharing you lose nothing, in sharing you gain something. You'll be in for the big surprise for touching other people's lives. Nothing feels better than the heart's sweet smiles. When you share what you can do, fulfill their heart's desires. It's a great time to share with whomever is there. It's always nice to share anytime, anywhere. Come in. You can sit there if you want. Thank you, Ingo. Um, um, Ingo, we have something for you. For me? Yes. <laughs> huh? What is this? What could this be? Oh, <laughs> my book! Ooh. How did you know it was mine? Ingo? Over there! Um, Ingo, it has your name on it. It has? It does have my name on it. This book. It's a good thing that you were able to find the book and you were able to return it to the owner. This book is a collection of poems and stories. Do you want to borrow it? Really? Oh. Yes! Thank you very much, Ingo. I love stories! Share, Ingo. Good. <laughs> Very good.